you want to launch an online course, but you're not that tech savvy and you don't have a large budget to be paying $100 to have your course hosted and you don't even know if it's going to sell. Well, you've come to the right place and this is a video that I have created just for you. I'm going to teach you step by step how to create your online course and set up your online course on your stand store. Let's get started. What you're going to do is you're going to sign up for the free trial. You have 14 days and here we're going to go ahead and sign up and we're going to get inside so that we can start creating that online course. Upon signing up, this is what's going to happen. Once you are already done and you've input your information, such as email and name, um, it'll tell you basically it's an all in one store and you get to choose whether you want the annual or you want to pay the monthly fee. It's only $29 a month, which is amazing compared to all the other uh, online course hosting platforms that I know of, which are extremely expensive. And to, when you're starting out, you don't want to pay $100 for, you know, just to host an online course. And the cool thing is that you're not just hosting an online course. You can do many different things, sell different types of digital products, uh, create a membership where people can sign up and, and be able to access your content every single month. There's a wealth of options when you are, are creating your stand store. Once you're in, you must choose your niche, whether it's health, business coaching, finance, social media, spirituality, mindset and motiv motivation. I'm just going to go ahead and choose mindset and motivation here. Please share handles of stand creators you saw. Great. And then once you're in, you are going to have this home page. This is where you can add your profile picture. You can add all the uh, social media accounts that you have. You can set up your direct deposit and you get to create your first product. Once I click on my store, we see here this amazing button that says add a product. So we're going to click on add a product. Then you have digital products, maybe a coaching call or it's uh, you can add a link to like an external site that you may have or your or an, uh, an affiliate link. But I want to click on here where it says advanced products and the product that we will create today is an e-course. If you want me to produce a step by step tutorial on a specific video, a personalized step by step tutorial just for you for the book that you are trying to create, go ahead and check out my stand store where you can actually book a step-by-step -step tutorial that I can create for you based on your request and your needs. Check it out and back to the video. And here, uh, very important, when when you pick a style of the button, you know, you'll see where I'm pointing at here. If you choose the one that says button, I would choose this if you are going to uh, maybe for like an ebook, if you're going to sell an ebook or maybe a downloadable template or something like that. But if you're selling an online course, I would definitely choose call out and you'll see how this expands and you can actually add more content here. And that's exactly what we want for the online course. Now here you get to select an image. When you click on choose, you can go ahead and choose from what's already available or you can create your own and it already gives you uh, the dimensions that you could just plug into onto Canva, which is a 400 by 400. So that's great. Now here under title, you can put the title of your course, how to create an ebook in seven days. Okay. And then the subtitle could be learn how, let's say, let's see how to create an ebook. And you can go ahead and put, uh, Create an ebook in seven days. That's going to be your subtitle, something like that. And then in, you could leave it like that where it says get, get my course. And that's exactly how it will reflect here uh, when someone clicks on your stand store link. Then we click on next. And here is we get to choose another image, which if you see here, it's an image that's going to be in the background of as soon as someone clicks on the link for your course, then they're going to come here. And this content is exactly what your customer will see before they even pay for the course. Now let's go ahead and choose an image for this. Let's say it's this one. Okay. And then you get to add, add the, the content that you wish. Get started with this amazing course. You can leave it at that. And then here you are basically telling people what they will expect 
uh, when they actually purchase the course, what are they going to get? Are they going to get maybe uh, a step-by-step, step-by-step system, how to write, let's see, how to write content, uh, let's see, how to use Canva to create the book cover. I actually did this for my online course where I teach people how to create their poetry books. Check the description down below and you'll be able to see the link to that if you're interested in creating a, a poetry book. Once you're done with the course description here, you will see the bottom title where it says get my course. You can write something else if you'd like. Then the call to action button will say purchase. And here you would set up your price as soon as you set up your PayPal or your Stripe account. You will be able to set the price there. Then you leave this field as it is, at least for me, I leave it as it is. And then I click on next. And here is the actual meat of your course. Okay, this is exactly where you're going to add your modules, your lessons. So let's say, for example, your first lesson is just a welcome video. You can add the modules as you wish. You can modify this as you want. Let's say, for example, you don't want to do this and break it down in modules. Not a problem. You can go ahead and delete the module itself. Delete this one. And all you're going to have, you can even edit what's on the top. Rename the module. And you could you could put something like create getting get started or something like that get started or you can even put something like let your journey begin right okay great so now we're gonna write that and then lesson one is the welcome lesson two is the overview and you could just continue to add lessons and what's cool here let me just go back to the course builder what's cool here is let's say for example lesson number one you're going to click on that okay here is where you are going to write what lesson number one is all about you see it says key takeaway one two and three and then here's where you upload the video let's say you created your video and your video is straight from your phone and you just use lavalier mic, this is where you would be uploading your video. You don't need fancy gear to start your online course journey. All you need is a tripod that you can get on Amazon. Make sure that you have a lavalier mic, and when you set up your tripod, make sure that it is firm so that it can hold up your phone. And this is just a test to make sure that my mic is working, and we are ready to record. Make sure that you know exactly what you're going to teach on that lesson. Be prepared. And then if you created maybe like supporting resources such as a list or templates, you would upload it here, what if especially if it pertains to this particular lesson. So let's just go ahead and save as draft and we're going to continue. And then, okay, so once this each course is set up and you've already uploaded the video and you put some content here, and what's even cool, what you can do is, for example, let's say in this particular uh, description, you want to go ahead and add an image, you can. You can add it in the beginning, you could add it in the middle or at the end. Let's go ahead and see what that looks like. Let me click on here. And then I'm just going to click on something that I already have. And then you can add it. And you could, what I love about uh, Stan Store is that you could see exactly what it's going to look like on, on someone's phone. And this is exactly what it will look like. So it's kind of cool. And then you just upload the video. And then once you're done uploading the video, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to go ahead and upload any video. Okay, I'm uploading a video right now. And as you can see here, you can see the video here on the side, which is pretty cool. And then you just start building your course just like this. I'm going to go ahead and save as draft. And then here I'm under course. Perfect. And you just continue to build on lesson one, lesson two, lesson three, so on and so forth. Your videos don't have to be perfect. They can be shot straight from your phone with your lavalier mic. And all you have to do is produce quality content. Once you are done, we're going to go ahead and uh, you can click on publish. Now, it doesn't end there. You can go ahead and add a landing page. It says create a landing page, drive customers to an exclusive product link. You can create a landing page directing someone to one of your products. But let's go ahead and go to where it says edit design. This is where you are going to create the look. 
of how your store will look like when someone clicks on your link. Okay, this is Stan Classic. Then we have this one right here. You have this one. I personally, I really like this black one. I like, I like this one a lot. Um, and then you have this one. And let's go with this one. This one's extremely colorful and I love it. So I'm just going to go ahead and save. We're going to click on home and we're going to add a profile pic. Confirm. Great. Now let me go ahead and go back to my store. And guess what? We have an image. But guess what? We need to see those products. We want to see how that looks like. And there you go. There you have it. And you are ready to start selling. Let's head on over to where it says income, which is where you're going to be receiving funds and you will be able to keep track of how many sales you're making. Then you have your analytics and this is where you need to keep track of how many people visit your store, uh, what's your conversion rates and things like that. So as you start building some traction and people start clicking on your link, you'll be able to see the conversion rates and where the traffic is coming from. Is it coming from Instagram? Is it coming from uh, just other sites, YouTube and things like that. When you think about, a, about an online course, what I would love for you to grasp from this video is that you don't need a huge production to be able to produce a valuable online course. All you really need is your phone and just a lavalier mic. And with these two tools, you can go ahead and upload the video onto your stand store and be able to sell your online course as fast as today. Go ahead and click on the link below, begin your stand store, start exploring, and it is the easiest, the fastest, and the most affordable way for you to begin selling your online course online.